Hey folks, welcome back to Forever Skies. I'm just kind of sitting here looking out the cockpit of this this plane, looking at uh, Poncho over here. Moved him up to the front so we could see him uh, doing his, his goofiness while we're flying. Got our two auto extractors out there, desperately needing batteries. I already used the battery off this one. Now remember the last time I, right in the middle of the episode, the glass had just vanished and I fell through? Well, I reloaded this time and it's gone completely. So I think the idea of having indoor stuff outside is not going to work. <laughs> I don't know if there's glass here or not. There might be. But there's definitely nothing over here. I can see myself drop and go back up. Yeah. So drop off and boom. Okay. So, yeah. I think we're, uh, we're done with trying to get ultra creative it's not working so let's turn this guy on and grab some catwalks until I run out of metal I'll go out here at the very least let's get uh, that that first step taken care of not enough resources okay very very cautious about that one can I uh, boy I hate to disconnect that I don't know if all this will collapse or not Hmm. Let's go gather some resources. Um, I think I've already stripped that place out pretty good, so we need to go somewhere else. I did go back. I put this back in. I don't remember last time if I pulled it out or not, but I've talked about moving it to the back. That's right. I did pull it out. I put it in the back and found out that you can't go up because of the balloon up there. So... I didn't want it over here because it took the space of the of the fabrication area, so I just extended the balloon further out or the the, the ship further out. So now we've got the the two bays available for the fabrication area. Eventually, this will all be wall shelves, and and I'm not sure what the back end is going to finally do, but this gets us by for now. So I did go back up into here. I like this design. I like being able to pop up into here and open the doors you got a crouch to come out here but got access to your engine which should be at the back of a ship i see so many people just plopping it in the front with the flames blowing right into their ship and not think anything of it this thing blows a, f a, f a jet flame out his back end it probably shouldn't even be that close to the balloon actually but you know you get a side win and that you're gonna light that thing off but anyway got our turbine up here to give us some height and completely enclosed so you can't accidentally fall off. Uh, let's try that again. There we go. So that is there. I'm thinking probably bedroom, office, furniture sort of over here. This will be fabrication and what have you. I'm not sure what to do with the very front or out here in the middle. Maybe we'll find some uh, sofas or or some kind of a dining space or who knows what. Common area. If this were a ship on a show like uh, Firefly, you know, this is where the big table would be for the everyone to meet for, for dinner. So let's think that way. Anyway, let's go explore. We've got a question mark out here. We're over there. So let's kind of maybe hit this group in here on our way to that and eventually over here to the greenhouses and get some more glass. So we need supplies, we need glass, we have fuel, we do. In fact, there's the fuel gauge right there, and it is solid blue. All right, lifting off, and calories are decreasing. So we are taking off and heading kind of in that general area right there, right into that building. Yeah, so let's go around. <laughs> now, it is nice being able to look down and out, but... It's just not working. I guess while we're here, let's go ahead and grab this one. So let's, oops, send this guy up in the air. Uh, this would be, what, a 244? I can't remember the, or is that more like a, whoa, I let go of the wrong button. I'm way up there now. Okay, try that again. There were some that were 238, some that were 244s. This is the, 244. Okay. Yeah, 
that's going to get a little crazy. Let's see if we can grab some metal. Right in there. And grab some glass. And it's treating this like a solid wall, so it doesn't want to doesn't want to let me in. Oh, there's a tiny little hole right in there. Nope. We are doing a lot of swaying. Look at that. Let's grab the copper while we're here. Oh, there's metal. I'll take you. Nope, I won't take you. Grab the copper. There's a little something peeking through there. Perfect. And something peeking through. Oh, metal. Peeking through there. Yeah, we're doing a lot of swaying, and it's, it's killing my aim. Hmm. There was a patch that came out today that the ship... To stop the ship from shaking, they called it. I don't know if that's what they're talking about or not. I don't remember there being this much swaying in this ship. So apparently there's been some kind of an update between last episode and this one, and it, uh, it has affected some things. There's always going to be an episode or an update that's always going to uh, potentially do something crazy. Now, can I get anything else in here? Oh, there is a hole over here. Right there. I gotta... I see I gotta move my my pointer with the sway of the ship. Let's see if I can pull that off. Ah, got one. Okay. All because I know I'm gonna fall right through there. I just know it. <laughs> Alright, catwalk. I need synthetics. Alright. Let's pull off over here. Run down to the end. I need to get some food anyway. But this big box for now is full of the synthetics and metals. Meaning that's where they're going to go when I actually get some synthetics and metals. Okay, I bet you I can't shoot that from in here because it'll say you can only do it outside. There we go. Catwalks. So we're going back to traditional outside stuff on the outside. Oh, I hate when this thing bounces all around. So eventually I'm going to reload and that's going to be gone. So how much do I have? I have enough. Let's go ahead and make that gone now, but I'm going to step back a ways. I don't trust it. So there and there. And then turn you off, turn you back on. Give me four more of these guys. There. Okay. And I've noticed that my food and water levels are dropping fast, like the game has kicked me into a higher difficulty mode. Hardly do anything, and all of a sudden these bars are all yellow again. So I think something, that's another thing that has possibly changed with uh, with updates. It changed the, uh, the timing on some of these things. Alright, get you there, and let's get two more coming. I really like this double system here. Two of those and two of those. We can go off and exploring while it's cooking. Wow, this ship is really bouncing. It really is. Okay, so let's... Yeah, I think that is what they're talking about by, by shaking. Let's go forward. And drop down. Now we've landed. And it seems to be stable again. Okay. Grab you. <clears throat> oh, almost almost ruined that. You and you over here. Drop you in boil. Drop you in boil. Okay. While they're cooking, let's go explore. Let's drop off some things first, though. And I'm going to need uh, sleep, though I just maxed out my sleep before I started this episode. That's why I'm, I'm saying it seems like it's really... I don't know. The, the pace has changed. Okay, so put you away, get going. I do have my knife with me if I need it. Cutting into anything or breaking off a lockbox. I don't have the extractor with me. I probably should grab that. Where is that? Oh boy, here, no, here, yeah, okay. You're my new number three. And I see I've got that I don't need. Okay. Do have enough water? 
Let's do this. Go ahead and grab the copper that's hiding in here that's hard to... Well, I guess I could grab this one on the way out. Okay. Does this get me anywhere underneath? It does. That's a little different structure. And that's a drop-off. And that's a head bunk. Yeah, I think I'm not doing that. Let's be sensible about this. <laughs> I like living. I, I, I just do. <laughs> okay, so am I over the top of an axis? Or ax oh, wait, I can get in there. I can access it this way. That's right, I did see that. Okay. Um, we can go off like this. That works. Into here. We've got glass hiding in there. This place is really looking abandoned. Well, I guess I did strip some of the walls down, so that probably does change the uh, the initial impression. Pop you, you. Okay, that one, that one, that one. Those two are nice. Another patch. Lots of patches. Okay. <clears throat> yeah, let's grab this glass while we're here. Anything else hiding in there? This internal one can only be grabbed from this side. No, he's just dead. There doesn't seem to be... Oh, it's right at this edge. Okay, I've noticed that. Sometimes you got to really search for the hitbox to make this work. Okay, that's this area. Three away. One around the corner here. Grab the helium. And might have a storm coming in. Go out this way and grab the copper that's hiding in there. I try to use the duck gun when I can. It's free batteries, or free power for that one. As compared to these other ones that have to be charged. So you drop in, grab you two, and up, I think. Ah, there is that one over there, but... I can't get over there. I've tried that before. Crouch on that, try to jump up from a crouch, and it won't let me. So we'll go from the top down. And how did I not see you? Okay, so can I get there from here? Oh, it does let me in. Okay. Battery is here. Nice. And drop into here slowly, because it does throw you forward quite a bit. And back out of here. Three away. Any other... Those I can hit with the deck gun. Nothing else around. Look at all the lights under that ship. Which does feel like a waste. The bottom side of the ship. Except for strategically placed. But you don't get a choice. If you're going to have a metal floor, you're going to have lights underneath. Alright, no storm. So we've been in there... We went in there and there. I guess that was all of them. Okay. So best way up is... I'm going to say here. Alright. Nothing else from the top. No, we're good. Back on deck. Alright. Do I trust you? No, I don't. Alright, we're going to go back to real metal deck. All the way around. Once we can afford it. Okay, again, like I said last time, I sure wish these gray stripes were right here. That lets you know it's real. Okay, so grab both of those and toss you into the, the new food box until we get food cabinets. And drop you guys off and possibly grab a nap. Let's see, glass goes in there. And need a new fuel box. For now, I think it's sitting right here. So that'll get us by for the moment. Yeah. Um, those don't go in. Okay. Well, toss the one arrow and put you in there. Batteries can go down there. Knife goes there. Metals. And an arrow. Do I have a room here? I do. I'll toss an arrow in there. In fact, let's toss all but five in there yeah okay well that was quick dirty give us the materials thank you very much let's go pull back gotta pass by 
Ah, right there. Pull this way. And grab. You're out of range, aren't you? But you aren't. Now take that metal right there. And there. Oh, out of range. Get. And you. You. And you. Okay. So that is... Yeah, you're out of range. I think that's good for now. Metal. And no more copper. But you are in range. Gotcha. Alright. Next. We are... Two question marks now. But those, but the one over there is near the greenhouses. Okay, so let's go that way. So we're heading like so. I'm gonna hit anything. I'm getting close. All right, so heading for this this lower level platform, and we're really close to these guys. In fact, let's just throw a battery in there and let let him do his job. Uh, grab you and you and turn you on. Eventually we'll be ahead on batteries, but for now we'll take building materials. Uh, there's a copper there. Can I... Whoa! Can I get under... There? I can. Good. Metal. Alright. So, probably just a materials collecting episode. We'll see. We'll see if we can get to that question mark and if there's time to, to deal with it. Now, this is a kind of an interesting looking platform here. Spin around, drop down to 228. 32. Quick. Oh, crunch. <laughs> yeah, there's a lot of sway in this thing now. That was not there before. That is different. Yeah, grab a... What is that one? Four. Touch you up. Okay. And yeah, you just do your job. Thank you very much. When we find the uh, advanced version of that, we'll be able to set those just for metal. And it will only pull metal in, or whichever you choose. Metal and copper or glass. If you've got so much synthetics, there's no point in continuing to collect it. And that's back down under the dust. That's your second trip down, you find that one. Uh, nothing else here? Water's here. I'll take that. Grab a new battery. I think for now we'll just run the one, there we go, the one uh, extractor. Okay, and I can see him from there, so I don't need to collect that one. Where did the building go? Am I missing something? Apparently I am. Is there a building on this one? Let's go down a little lower. We're up here. We went up twice. Okay, looking through. I don't think. Oh, there you are. I was going to say, I don't think I've seen a platform that didn't also have a building. Ah. Okay, plastics. Which really aren't as valuable as, as you think. I mean, it, it doesn't take much synthetics to make five plastics, so you could do without the scavenging, but the scavenging is one of the most fun parts of the game. So you gotta scavenge, otherwise why are you here? Any sun melons hiding around? Ooh, there's one. Good. Sun melons are good. They give you a better lure. Alright, so where's the ship? I can hit you from here. Door. I don't know if I can hit you from here. But I think we'll give it a try. Save the battery and the extractor for now. Alright, any data pads? New. No. 
You. Ah, data card. Simple storage rack. Okay. I wonder how simple that is. I'd want to store boxes at least too high. Oh, insect lure. Good. I'll skip the lantern. Grab the fuel, though. Alright, what'd I miss? Ah, right there. Two of them. Okay. I find that almost always first pass don't get everything. They they do blend in well. Alright, if I was going to try and get out of this place, how would I do it? Ah, <laughs> uh, there we are. Alright, let's go make that fancy lure and grab all the synthetics sitting out here and Try our best to get up onto the ship. There we go. Ugh. All right. Um, while I'm here, okay, we had two glass, and we can still see them. Good. You and you. Got the door. And over there. And I think I see something peeking through right about there. We need to check that out on our way. There was one up above. Oh, there's two up above. Ah, doing the swaying thing. And it's not locking on like it does the ones in the air. And there's one over here. Yeah, I'm having to ride my my uh, gun with it in order to catch these things now. And maybe that's just an added feature to the game and that's the way it's going to be. You know, make it feel a little more realistic. That's yeah, possible. Alright, let's make that lure before the uh, sun melon goes bad. Grab another couple drinks of water, and you, food, advanced lure, copper, plastic, sun melon. Perfect. Printing completed. Okay, had to re, had to move my mouse pad there, so the world swung around a bit. Okay, so we have not used these up yet. Let's toss these into here, and I need food. You are a 55. I'll just grab... Well, timing, two days, 15 hours. Okay, we'll grab you. And toss you and you in there. And that's good. Yeah, drink, eat you. And fuels here, temporarily. Right there. What else? Let's go back this way. Won't do any more building for a while. Maybe even no more this episode. Just collect. Oops, wrong way. Okay, you're all in there. You are materials. You are components. Okay. And battery. And that'll do it. Okay, some sleep. And the next platform. Stop the sleep early so we still have some light for this one. Alright, so we are swinging around. So we've been there. We're going to this one. Okay, yeah, we were heading that way before. Now we're heading this way. So just off to the right. So up. Uh, swing means what? Let's go a little higher and make sure there are no more materials that I couldn't... Oh, it's lower actually. Okay, I'm going to say that's just a light over there. So we're going to say this one's done. Over here... No metal towers to take down. Got a little damage over there, and it's always good when I can use up some of these things. Oh, one over there, too. You took some damage, huh? Okay. So, with that, let's get moving. So off to the right. Ship damaged. Yeah, it definitely has a different feel. The ship's swaying up and down like this, kind of rocking. I'm, unless there is actually a balance mechanic in the game now, and it depends on how balanced your ship is, you know, the design. I added a bunch of stuff out the back end before I started the episode. That's the one thing that has changed besides the uh, the deck disappearing out from under me. Now, can you guys knock this off? 
Who's been pounding on me? Hmm. Okay. So, off over here. And let's see what's up there. Anything down below? Uh, just a ladder. Yeah, it's always a little uh, nerve-wracking dropping down to go up. Especially the way it lurches you forward when you when you go down. No plastics. Got some waters. I didn't deal with the waters from last time, so I'm full. Okay, you guys. Both of you. There. Uh, don't need you in my face, so turn you off. And a couple more patches. Always way too many patches. Now, eventually we're going to get a module, a, a station that, let's see if I can get around all this, that will recycle. So I'm thinking you could, oh, that's a tight squeeze. Oh, let's see if this works. I think, officially, that, that floor is there. It's showing you that it's not there, but I think it counts. I can go around these corners just fine. It's their way of simulating having, you know, grabbed on and hanging on tight with your hands while you're walking around a corner. So, I mean, that kind of works. Everything? Not one more. Okay, so we got the battery. We do. We have two of them now. Okay, so drop you. And you can almost drop onto my ship there. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, uh-huh. Don't tell my mom I did that. <laughs> okay, so are we done here? Let's... Calories are decreasing. Yeah. Okay, we can't get anything from here except for these guys. Let's get up in the air a little bit. Oops, let's try going up first. Okay. I uh, guess I'm going to have to take uh, basic flying class again. Oops, wrong one. Ups and downs are always confusing to me. Always grabbing the wrong one. I don't see anything in there to shoot. A storm is coming. A storm is coming. Yeah, I noticed when I saw that, it felt like it was the one on the inside. And then I was confused as I was running in. Am I inside or outside? Am I running out into my doom or am I running in? So, yeah, inside floors probably should be on the inside. Let's drop you down. That deck, I don't think there's any deck under us. We're okay there. Dropping down into the lower 220s. Spend some time getting some food. Uh, toss you over, eat you, drink you. Let's swap out some uh, some waters. And that's wow! But it didn't hit us. It sure felt like it, but it didn't hit us. No warning came up that our ship's been damaged. Okay, so for that matter, let's send you guys down one more time. Nothing down there? Okay. And restock the fuel. Let's toss you into the miscellaneous box. And really, I didn't mean to grab you. So, I'll probably toss you overboard at some point. <laughs> and while we're waiting for those lures to come up, let's go ahead and put some of this stuff away. Um, basic supplies. Toss you two. And you two. And I think I want one more water bottle on me so I can grab dirty waters a little bit easier. I think I've got some stashed in here. Yeah. So that's just lightning that's hitting really close. Uh, drink one more of you. And let's toss some of this stuff into here. All right. There. Okay. Lures come up. They did. Boy, these automatic lures are nice. And we lost both of those. Okay. So cook you. Cook you and grab both of these. 
They're not going to last the same amount of time, but that's fine. And we're good there. All right, so we're down below waiting for the storm to end. And sleep. Yeah, let's top off the sleep while we're waiting. Get this a little closer to daytime again. The ship is safe down here. Won't take any hits. We don't need to babysit it. All right, daytime has arrived. Hopefully that means the storm's going to end soon. Uh, Charge-wise, let's toss you in there until we run out of battery. Little tiny green line left. No, there's still some battery left. Cool. I don't need you on me, though, but you're full. You're full. Yeah, no more miscellaneous boxes. Okay, leave you on me. All right, are we done yet? We're thinking hard about it. Uh, going next to the wind tower, just off to our side over there. Wind farm. So let's try and do that during the storm. See if we can get away with this. Go up a little bit. Oh, that's close. Swing over. That tower's over there. Tower is almost in front of us now, but I'm going to get my tail past those. Okay, swing over. And don't you, don't, 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 don't. And wind tower's over here. And 224. I was going to say, that's really low, but that's not the wind tower. That is one of the outlying uh, baby ones. The big one just hasn't come into view yet. Yeah, I think that storm's about done. I think, I think the lightning part of it is done. Let's grab this while we can. Yeah, may as well stock up for what will eventually be... Where are you? There you are. Another... Uh, Topping off the uh, the rooms of the ship, and I'm I'm gonna say we're done. Let's go up, and head into there. Yeah, grab that copper. Thank you. More? Run right, right there. Grab the copper. You can't grab the copper, huh? Copper full? No, I think it's the leftmost. Hey guys, stop breaking my ship. Though there's no th thunder and lightning right now to break the ship, when there is a storm, the projectiles out there, the floaters, the junk stream, they come in at a much faster rate. And so they actually damage you as if you're flying fast toward it. All right, you're over here. We need to be up at 244. We are there. Okay, so theoretically we're at the right height, even though it doesn't look like it. Swinging in... 245, yep. Yeah. Really an optical illusion. Right in there. Urgh. Down. See if we can land this thing this time. Yep, we're anchored. That should stop the sway. Okay, so stats are looking good. Let's get the food out of here so it doesn't overcook. Toss you guys into there. And let's go see what we've got. Anything I need to hit while I'm here? Sure, let's, let's clean all this stuff up. That it? No, something right over there. Okay, off over there. <clears throat> I'm guessing that's copper. Yep, that's copper. Uh, another. Nope, not a container. Uh, metal. Okay, I think we're good. Yeah, that feels like I'm inside the ship, and I'm not. So, that's all going away. It was it was a nice experiment, but it is disorienting, and I don't trust it anymore. Two reloads in a row, part of my ship was missing. I just can't trust it. That part of the game isn't stable yet. Alright, copper hiding in here. Don't know what, don't know what I'm going to do with all the copper, but let's grab it while we can for... When we f do figure out later what we're going to do with all that copper. You know, like the epoxy that you get to the greenhouses doesn't seem like there's much to do with it right now until you start building furniture. Then you need all kinds of it. You know, so if you get to where you... Ah, I don't need any more of that. Like repair kits. <laughs> yeah, skip all the repair kits. We've got plenty of them. And then you hit that one storm. And you can't get down fast enough, and lightning just wipes out 
the side of your ship or something or or you hit that high wind and accidentally enter the junk stream and everything is just pelted then you're wishing you collected that stuff anyway just stick it in a in a chest somewhere it'll be fine okay good there <clears throat> you no didn't miss anything more look at everything from a different angle oh hello I will take you thank you very much all right we got you down there Ah, right there. Did miss something. Okay. Now, what else is on this deck over here? I think that's it. Yeah. Are you stuck over there? Yeah, you've got a, a steel or metal floater. Just kind of stuck in the, uh, in the girders there. Okay. Down... And I'm going to drop while crouch. See if that slows down the forward motion. Doesn't. Yeah, it might have. Okay, crouch again. Oh, there's another helium over there. Okay. I don't know that I will put a second balloon on this, but I'm not going to rule it out. We'll keep collecting the helium anyway. Don't truly need to have helium fuel. That's not a priority. The game runs just fine on the others. And... I don't mind refueling once in a while. We don't really travel vast, long distances anyway. Mostly platform to platform, so you never really notice that you've been traveling and you run out of fuel, and you're traveling and you run out of fuel. Just, just make it work. Grab those two. Ah, another one over there. Okay. That one, and the one that I just saw floating by, uh, he's still hiding back over there. Okay, he'll be out of range by the time he gets there. Okay, so with that, let's go dump off some more supplies. So by the time this episode's done, we should have some stuff stocked up into here and kind of get ahead on, on inventory. Let's see, you, drop you and you off, and I just might not have enough room for fuel by the time we uh, get this next round in here we'll see so you in there ah, it does fit that maxed us out okay water is going off into this one right there okay that's good again and let's grab that was there a lettuce in there there was so grab that have it have it on us um, Water-wise, we are fine. And shall we go get another one? I think so. How long have I been recording? Um, just not too long after a half hour. We're good for a while. You're up. You're back. If you always plan it so that you can back straight out, you're never wondering what you're going to hit. So where are we going, though? We're actually going forward. So that is our question mark. That orange flashing light over there. Okay, let's go see what it is. And let's go pound a junk stream while we're doing it. So let's go up and over. Um, what am I seeing here? We have full containers. Is that what it is? Take glass. Now you can go take metal. All right, you guys do that for me. Up higher. There, yeah, we're clear. Alright, so what are we heading into? What is the question mark? And we're still looking for some things. We're looking for the, uh, the uh, station that builds furniture. We're looking for the kitchen cabinets. Well, I call it kitchen cabinets. Storage cabinets. And yeah, there is definitely a rocking back and forth. or up and down. With this guy like like head bob is on <laughs> but i'm not walking it's that's what it looks like it's like you know you can turn head bob on and off with a lot of games where you walk around in first person it's like head bob for the ship has been turned on huh let's come down 
and hopefully grab that metal over there. Alright, so what do we actually have here? Let's spin around and look at this. We have a, a city of some kind, a town. Look at the big exhaust pipes up there. So, I don't know if there's a landing at this side. It doesn't quite look like it. Looks like landing is right over there. So, let's go beyond. Okay, grab the metal. Thank you. Let's go beyond <clears throat> so that if we have to pull out, we can do that. It's already getting very cloudy again. There's another rainstorm. Yep. Wow, a little bit of, of a lag going on there. Unknown location, okay. Swinging in. Let's back up. Let's see this a little bit better. Boom, boom, boom. Those are not structures. I'm pretty sure that's uh, um, these guys. Yeah, we're getting really laggy. Wow. We are taking some serious damage right now. Okay, what is going on? Uh, five. Nothing over in here. <clears throat> That's what's going on. Our butt's in a junk stream. Yep, what did we hit? Hit something over there. Good there. Yeah, that's what's going on right there. Now, I can't get out there to fix that. Oh, that's interesting. I can do it here? No, it's considered outside even though it's the same piece. Now, there's a paradox. What do you do with that? Huh. Same thing there. Well, <clears throat> I guess they're going to be a permanent fireworks show. Unless I want to put a, a door here and a deck out there. And I hadn't planned on that. Or I could walk in from here and then walk in from around there. Going to have to get some outside access ways. Okay. Let's move you forward and drop. And we're docked. Okay. Small town. Analysis is completed. We're going to go find what? Hold tab. It is a a paint tool. I guess we don't have the paint tool in this in this series. Okay. So that's what's over here. That's the hard part about running a second series or a second a second save just for yourself. You know, just for fun. Is that you kind of lose track of what was in one save and what was in another save. Okay, we've got basic pattern cartridges. Has something to do with painting. We'll have to figure all this out sometime. Uh, you are a data pad. My dear Sarah, colors were her life. She couldn't get over the gray world we had we had left. After months of collecting parts and refining the design, I finally got it right. I built a paint tool with it. I will restore the colors to this reality. Darling, this is for you. If only you were still here to see it. <sighs> okay. So, sun melons. I'm going to definitely make some more lures out of those. Anything immediately out of here? No. Paint is not something I can collect. And we are really laggy here. Tempted to pop out, shut the game down, restart, and see if I get rid of all the lags. I am staggering all over the place in there. Something wrong with this part of the map. Let's go ahead and make this part, though, which was copper and plastic, or else copper and synthetic. I don't remember. Food, fancy lure, it was plastic and copper. Okay. Same thing there. Get you guys going. Eat that one. Printing completed. Okay. So those are taken care of. And yeah, I think I will shut down and restart and see if it makes a difference. 
Alrighty, so let's see if this is any different as far as the jitters. Either the computer was hot, or there is a something to do with with you know unoptimized area in this part of the map that's causing problems. But let's search this area, see what there is to see in this small city. Thing. There is a ladder. Oh, the ladder comes back. Okay. Hydration level. That drops down quite a ways. Let's grab a drink and head down. Okay. In here. That's not a hole in the floor. Okay. <laughs> Water. And. Water and repair kit, and I guess that is it there. Run and jump over. <clears throat> All right, we got to figure out what these basic pattern cartridges are. There seem to be a lot of them about, and with these different colors on the floor, I'm a little spooked on where I'm allowed to step and where I'm not. <laughs> Okay, Ooh, there it is, the paint tool. Okay, and a whole bunch of patterns that got tossed in with it. Okay, another cartridge. And where have I been and not been? This is where we just came from? I want to say it is. Yeah, they're opened up. Okay, though the diagonal... Nope, there's nothing to walk on. All right. Always looking for places that you're not meant to reach unless you get creative. Can I get to you? Yeah. Like right here. Oh, but I gotta grab these first. <laughs> Alright, there. <laughs> Duck over. No, that is it. No, not going that way. Okay, up. Nothing in there. Don't really like that jump. Let's see what else there is. Okay, we have a jump from that direction. You are where we grab the paint gun. Let's go this way. <clears throat> grab the knife. And I'm already getting tired. Man. Alright, in here. Good. Always use electrical components. What are you? Uh, anything to scan around here? Nothing. Okay. So you're not some container I didn't know about. Alright. And that blue spot in my peripheral vision looked like I was about to fall through there. Looks like there is a place to go up above. And there's a place in here. Let's travel this one first. Nope, nothing there. And that's where we would have jumped, but it was a little too spooky. Otherwise, we could have gone this way. I wonder if that goes somewhere. So we got to get up there. Got to peek down into here. Now it doesn't look like it goes anywhere. I'm not even going to try to get to those. That collapsed long ago. Okay, up there. Like so. Alright, this level. We got out there. We've got. I feel like we've been here. No, we haven't. You, one of you. Nothing else on the shelves. Nothing else on the walls. Alright, so we did come in from here. Okay. This is the, the path not taken last time. Alright, door. Door is locked from there. Interesting. <clears throat> I bet you it's going to make me shoot my way through through that opening over there. With the... Uh, can I go under? Yeah, okay, there we go. I thought it was going to make me shoot this with the, uh, with the gun. Alright, so we're in there. And lots of goodies. A couple of you, some drinks. Let's drink this one. 
get our uh, our stamina up a little bit. Both of you, old food, sure. I'll take that one right now. Uh, another one of you, and you look like some place we're meant to go. So are we done here otherwise? Did these came? Nope, missed you guys. Wow, missed a lot. Okay, can I walk through that? Yeah. All right, so we came from there, went around, came into here. Did we finish exploring this deck? What's in the box? Food. And I don't think I have room for it just yet. And you? No. So they sat out here and had meals and got up onto the roof from here. Which might be where that other ramp was about to take me. I don't know. Um, probably not. It doesn't seem to open up from down below. So we'll still have to get back down in there and deal with that. This is going to take me to maybe a battery? Ah, uh, maybe. This gets us into a room we haven't been to yet. Which is tempting to just jump into, except I don't know where the door is. You always want to make sure there's an exit before you jump into a place. We have sun melons up on the roof, so we got to get to there. Okay, so jump. Nope, doesn't want me to jump. Alright, so there is a way down. This is probably where that internal ramp was taking me to. Um, grab a two, grab the glass. Alright, you two. More of the stamina, so let's drink one. And I don't think I've got room for another one, so we'll wait on that. Data card. Curved wall lamp. We'll have to... I think we need that, that missing station in order to figure out where that goes. And this is where we were when we were trying to get up onto that. Okay, so that part is done. Um, how do we get to those sun melons? Up in there. So let's continue around. Have we been into this one yet? I uh, don't think so. Door? Well, there's an opening in the frame, but that doesn't come off. Same with there. There's an opening in the floor. Bet you that's got something to do with it. Let's find out. Ah, here we go. Uh, there's an opening that would. Are you? <laughs> He shot from there all the way through and took something. Interesting. Yeah, there's a way in from down below. Okay. Or... Nope, nothing from here. Okay, this is from that deck we were out on. Alright. You are... Interesting. Copper... Oh, we'll call it copper wiring. Okay. So we'll steal you. So a new form of copper has been introduced. Nice. Alright, this guy. We've been to this sun melon. I don't think we got into this building, but let's make sure. We did. Okay. So we've been here before. So now we just have to figure out how to get up to the sun melons, which is on this roof. Yeah. <laughs> Let's go around this way. See what else, what other options there are. Really aren't. Yeah, that's death right there. Bunch of good stuff over there, too. Alright, let's. Well, yeah. Now, the average player would go over there and do their best to leap over certain death. This player realizes he owns an airship. He doesn't have to leap over certain death. Just fly over there. Silly. Alright, so... Where are we trying to get to? Uh, right there. Drop back. Down. Swing. Yeah, right over there. Of course, we have a ship bop going on now. And the ship's bouncing up and down all over. 
There we are. Let's go and see what we've got. We'll take some of those. Thank you very much. And both of those. And I think we'll... Oh, got that one and that one. All right. Jump back onto the ship. And let's get up on that roof. Right there. And it looks like there's a ladder in between, so I can go for the lower deck just, just fine. Balloon is not a problem. It doesn't stick out. Though I can see maybe needing to add another... Let's grab the deck tool. I did throw this box in this box in while I was away so there we go let's swap you with one of you all right you're number four now A storm is coming. no storms aren't allowed four oh I bet you I can't I bet you I don't have any synthetics yeah see this is why you have extra repair kits around let's go to the top one then There we go. Drop you down there. Extra repair kits for when that storm comes in and you're almost done but not quite yet. Inventory's full! And that happens and you gotta run back in and you gotta take a whole bunch of hits while you're just trying to get you know the basics done here. Uh, metals and there, 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 and you and you, and let's eat the food, and let's uh, charge the tool, and fuel is over here today, and eat another, no, we'll leave that food, we'll drink one of you though, and you? Now, you. Okay, toss you in there. And I think we'll drink you, and that's enough. Now let's go finish this job. Well, the storm has not produced any lightning. It's actually kind of nice. All right, a couple of you. Three? Three of you. No, two. Okay. One of you. All right, that's three of them. And you would normally be the big chilies. So none of you. We didn't get onto that roof. That roof doesn't look like there's anything on it. We did get the battery. I'd say we're probably done here. Oh, no. There's something I haven't been to. And I have no way to... Oh, I can. Let's remember this ladder's here. Yeah. Remember where we parked the ship, okay? Uh, three. Three. <laughs> All right, so what good did that do us? Gave us enough to, uh, there's the chilies. Okay, we'll take you, and we'll go ahead and grab the chilies if we can fit them. So that finishes this place off. Nothing else hiding in there. Nothing above. Oh, we got these. I'll grab them while we're here. So we never entered from this direction. Was there something that we missed? Ah, a few more of the of those. Okay. And from here would have been a jump. We came in from right here. Up the ladder. And we went around that way and never got back, I think, if it's the same building. Okay. I'm gonna call that good enough. Let's get out of here. Yep. No thunder and lightning this time. Can I make this jump? I can. Alright, well, um, waters. What well, we could. Let's add you back into uh, there. Otherwise, we're good on water. Let's make a couple more fancy lures. Uh, you are food, and we basically 
are out of everything. Okay. So, let's what? I need an empty container. So let's drop... Hmm. Any empty boxes left? There's one. So what do I swap out for you? Let's swap you with you. Put you... Um... Let's just toss you right here for now. So five. Do that. Temporarily. Let's dump these guys off. Except for two. Go ahead and cook you. And... Throw water in there. Cook you. Grab water. And... Over here. Copper plastic. Sun melons. There we go. One of you. Food. One of you. Oh, that was quick. One more. Okay, put you guys away. Printing completed. Perfect. And don't need to pull up any more mobs for a while. What are you? Oh, you're the leftovers of what was the little storage area by the bed last episode. Okay. So you are fuels. You got room for you? Oh, wrong way. Like that. Okay. Foods. Back here. Toss you in there. Ah, oh, we're bouncing. It does that when you walk up against a box and then come into this mode. It's still trying to move forward and it can't. So, foods, I want to toss the rest of you guys in. So, let's eat you. Uh, don't really have space for you, but... Uh, you're still good for another... Uh, only 16 hours. I would just do it. So, you go in there and grab you and you. Let's toss that water in there. And... Two more. Get these guys cooked. There's only first aid kits that I remember being able to... Although, we do have this guy. Let's do that. Toss you in there. Ah, you don't work. Okay. Uh, Sunmelon? You do. Let's do this real quick. Oh, let's see here. We're going for this guy, so we need to get rid of those three. Right there. That was simple. Alright. Second try. We're going for him. So get rid of all the large ones. And then we want to get rid of all of the uncharged ones. That does it. Okay, third try. We want him. We need to get rid of three mediums. So he's a small. And three larges. Let's try large. And negatives. Hopefully you two are not the same. Acid? Ah, you're both neutrals. So it doesn't work. So this one's a fail. Try it again. It's going to give us another try? Yeah. This time we won't get rid of the larger, get rid of the mediums. At least I think that's what I did last time. Then we will get rid of the negatives. Then... There they are, the alkalines. And that did it. Okay, so now we have a virus sample for... Photophobia. Okay. And... That's it, we used our sun melon. Okay. So let's cook these guys. Alright, so that's done. Uh, Food-wise, we're kind of out of room. So we need to find the... Uh, the place that has got the uh, freezer and get that built. That's what we'll use a lot of the helium for. Okay. So, what else is left? Um, you guys are going over here till we figure out what to do with you. So, another sample. So, we got sample of vertigo, sample of fever, and a sample of photophobia. Okay. There's water. Um, do you fit, or do I just drink you? You're not water. Right there. You fit. Okay. And you go back over there. And I think we are about to call this one done. Did you guys finished? Yeah. So, 
that was this place out of battery again and got our paint tool um, is there any doing anything with that just yet just out of curiosity let's just play with it a moment uh, that didn't work I didn't mean to recharge you but give me my there's an E I just meant to grab that okay so let's toss you in here there we go five all right paint menu so we need basic cartridges desert okay so basic cartridges will get us these four so far jungle toad what is a jungle toad let's find out what a jungle toad is Uh, we'll paint this wall with Jungle Toad. Okay. That's, that's, that's really green. <laughs> Pink, dark, that looks more like, uh, army green. And desert, now that looks pretty interesting. Eh? I guess that's it. It doesn't look like the picture. Maybe it's the lighting. Maybe it's sunset. That should be a lot brighter in the middle. Hmm. We'll check that out next time when I, when we're not uh, with the, the really harsh lighting coming in. So with that, I think we will call this one done. It's been a good episode. I'll catch you next time, folks. Bye-bye.